All right, 734 right now. And a warning for those of you in Waikiki, you might have seen or even heard a helicopter flying in the area. Yeah, Jai joining us now with well, what's happening uh, high above the skies in Waikiki. Not too high. Good one, too, Jai. Right now, right behind us, I'll actually step out of the way and you can see that helicopter drop that's going on. It's obviously drawing a lot of attention. There's a lot of things to see in Waikiki, uh, but a low-flying helicopter that is above the international marketplace, that's a new one that you don't see every day. Uh, so what they've had is FAA restrictions uh, for the last couple of hours from 6.30 until 8.30 this morning. Folks aren't allowed in the marketplace. So you actually have seen police officers and security guards uh, that are keeping folks out of the marketplace. But what they're doing is they're uh, putting heavy equipment up on to the top of one of the restaurants that's being built. The restaurant's name is Yamacha, uh, and so there's air, air conditioning and different heavy equipment that's being lifted onto uh, the rooftop here at International Marketplace. So until 8.30 this morning, the marketplace remains closed. It should open up again at 9 o'clock, and that's also a heads up for anyone uh, who is visiting in the area or living in the area, working in the area. That noise you're hearing uh, likely until 8, 8.30 this morning. That is a helicopter. It is scheduled and was planned. Uh, and so there is no need to fear uh, having this low-flying helicopter in the Waikiki area. But again, this is happening right now, and it should be done relatively quickly. We've already seen the helicopter make three or four different passes between uh, the top of the uh, parking structure and in the restaurant portion of this. And so by 9 o'clock this morning, the international marketplace should be back open for business. And again, not to be concerned, this was a scheduled and planned helicopter operation. All right, let's head back into our wake-up-today studio. Thank you, Jay.